three of the Silverado of the radiator. Um, I'm gonna do a video. I'm gonna crack these this puppy open on both sides and test it to see which one was the issue that had the leak. But uh, um, I'm thinking uh, either one or maybe both were damaged. And this was a, a, a radiator from Napa. Uh, you see this part right here? This was leaking after the warranty expired. So that's the top. This is the bottom. Uh, this is the drain plug right here. So it's, it's on this side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and uh, auto parts drive it right now. See how it runs. And bring some antifreeze drain it from that plug where I just showed you on the old radiator and put new antifreeze in it because uh, there was corrosion building in with the water it's not good to be using water because you'll build corrosion inside some of these parts are aluminum and the aluminum will, co will create corrosion faster than then that starts deteriorating and you have leaks everywhere so I'm just looking at right now Everything seems fine, it's steady, it's like the way it's supposed to be. And this radiator, I actually got it at, uh, you ain't gonna believe it, at, on Amazon for $108. That's right, $108 on Amazon. And you're gonna say, why would you be so cheap? Well, guess what? Por que no? It's the same thing. This is made in China. This is made in China. And if this one breaks, I spend another hundred bucks. That's two hundred dollars. I don't mind taking this off. This, to me, is like, it's like just sweeping up. Easy, easy, easy. And like I said, if you need all uh, you know, everything, I got a video also when I actually changed. And install this one in here for the first time when it when this trick broke down on the radiator and then now guess what now it, it, it was worse so this radiator um, now it seems it's working perfectly I don't see anything like I said I'm gonna, I'm gonna drain it right now drive it drain it put any freeze in it and maybe if I start seeing a little bit of build up on the, on the deposit I'll do another flush and put more antifreeze. I don't mind doing that because it's, uh, you know, there could be oil somewhere inside the block and eventually it will just circulate, end up over there and then drain it out. All right, guys, I hope you liked the video. You need to share a comment. And thank you for watching Sanchez Scrapper TV. Peace.